Signed as a 16-year-old in 2019, Roberto Campos is now an 18-year-old outfielder who's considered a big part of the core of the Tigers' next generation of up-and-coming prospects. It's the power in his arm and his bat, which both grade out above average, that has the organization excited about this 6'3", 200-pounder. Playing 39 rookie ball games in the Florida Complex League in 2021, Campos belted eight home runs while playing primarily in center field. Uh, you know, something that uh, you practice and develop it, and you know, it's it's delightful to see and hit the ball and knowing that the ball is flying. It's something I really, really love. Uh, you know, since I was a kid, I always, I always was. I, they put me on the cleanup spot, maybe in the fifth, in the lineup. And I always, I always played there, and uh, then, then I realized there was a championship, and that I, I, I had a, over 600 of average, and I finished the championship with five home runs. And but the thing that made me realize is that all of the homers were line drives. So that's how I realized that I had some problem. A 2021 third round draft pick, Dylan Smith made a visit to Detroit later in the summer, but he won't make his professional debut on the mound until this spring. 6'2", 180 pound righty out of Alabama brings with him a plus slider and an above average curveball to pair with a fastball that tops out around 95 and a changeup. Smith led the Crimson Tide in innings pitched and strikeouts last year with 113 strikeouts left him third all time for a single season at Bama. Dylan Smith is a is a good athlete, still upside, a lot a lot of room to fill in with the body. Uh, delivery arm works great for a starter. Uh, good breaking ball spins it well. So I think there's some big upside there. Like Smith, Isaac Pacheco was a member of the Tigers 2021 draft class. A shortstop, Pacheco has tremendous size at 6'4", 225, and he won't turn 20 until after he completes the upcoming season. That frame, scouts project, will translate into above average power, which showed in spurts during rookie ball last summer. Pacheco hit his first pro home run, while also adding a pair of triples and four doubles. Big power from the left side, good hitter. Um, he can play short. I, he's he's a, such a big guy that probably probably end up moving off depending on how his body goes. Anyway, really talented kid, really good hands, plus plus arm, good accuracy, good actions. His, his lower half for a big guy and his feet work really well. Uh, we think he's going to play short. If he had to go to third, he'd be a plus defender at third with a plus arm. The Tigers were ecstatic to get the Big 12 Pitcher of the Year, Ty Madden, with a 32nd overall pick in 2021. The former Texas Longhorn has yet to make his pro debut, but scouts like him as an above average talent who pairs a plus fastball with a plus slider. In his final college season, the 6'3", 215 pounder led the Big 12 Conference with 137 strikeouts while tallying an impressive 245 ERA. We were, to be honest with you, surprised that he fell that far. We thought he was going to kind of be a tweener for us, a competitor again, great arm, good slider, uh, shows a good change up too, um, and um, just kind of a workforce guy on the mound with, with a great competitive edge to him.